So for me, whenever creative, oh, sorry, not creative, whenever things happen during my day, world events, personal events, it doesn't matter what it is, I use a journal to creatively elaborate situations that may have arose, that can arise, and I always give life to this fictitious enemy, so to speak, of how I need to combat in this really effective sense. I've been doing this since high school. You know, it, it's not a delusion or it's not another character or uh, split personalities or anything like that. It's pure academic. It's pure It's pure creativity. So, And it allows you to see these different viewpoints that can occur. And interestingly, when I make analyses, those principles really allow you to create a more pure and or unblemished reality because of all the potentialities you can really consider, you can put together. And that's how sometimes I can be so accurate with how I portray things or predict things because of the vividness of creativity and what it allows you to see as a, as a pure principle. So in other words, I would, I would encourage people Many people, no, as many people as possible, I would encourage you to keep a journal. I keep it on my phone. It's nearly all electronic. Keep a journal that allows you to creatively elaborate on events. Obviously, none that exist. Many position of yours that may not even exist. Yeah, obviously, for me, I have no hostility towards another human being. I have personal enemies, but pff, I deal with them in my way and nonviolently. In general, anyway, the point is, I... A lot of these depictions of reality, most of them are actually kind-based. But they're not... They're exactly that. They're fantasizing... Not fantasizing. They're creatively depicting a reality that could be, whether it's good, bad, violent, non-violent, etc. And a journal helps you... A creative journal and commenting on the day's events. It's a, Really, it's a commentary. Right, and commenting on the day's events, putting things in special columns, and a lot the way I like to put it, and and it fucking gives you this mad angle. That's it. Especially for me, I like to mess around with hackers because I know that hackers uh, get a lot of information from your phones these days, and if they read that stuff. They're like, "What the fuck?" And it always works. They always get caught on that stuff. It's fucking funny. Point is, for me, most of my material, nearly all of it, on my material on my phone is highly creative. I think people need to be a bit more creative, unto a good purpose, not unto, not unto uh, being malicious or anything like that. 